my name is Nikki Quinn and this is my arc length project for AP Calc. So I decided to do a path that um, I use when I walk the neighbor's dog. So I live in Inglewood and I have some friends who are also neighbors in Inglewood Cliffs that I walk their dogs for. And the path that is 1,185 feet and 1,233 feet and the curve is the path that I would normally take to walk their dogs. So I will be analyzing this curve that I'm outlining right now. Yes. So I turned the borders into the X and Y axis, and so there you go. And the coordinates are going to be six of the points shown here. I then used the Google Maps measuring tool to find the exact coordinates of each point as shown in this table. And then, Using the polynomial regression widget from Wolfram Alpha, I found the equation of the arc to be shown at the top in green. I set the settings on the polynomial to be of degree 4 or less to achieve the greatest accuracy. Now here's the graph. This is a graph of the full function with the arc length of interest between the two blue points. Um, so indicated blue, blue. And this led me to conclude that the arc would be measured between 0 and 1,242. With the original function, I derived it using the power rule and got the derivative f prime. As mentioned in my last slide, a is 0 and b is 1,242. Then I plugged these numbers into the arc length formula, which is outlined in the purple. After inputting all of the values, I found that the curved path was 1,934 feet, which rounded to about 0.366 miles. So in conclusion, what I calculated uh, using the arc length formula was 0.366 miles for this curved path. And what the actual distance of the path using the Google measuring tool was 0.332 miles. And then I calculated the percent error, which was about 10.2%, um, relatively small, which meant the arc length formula was successful. That is my arc length project. Thank you.